Alexander Donovan was a successful lawyer in 1846 at the outbreak of the War of Mexico. His eloquence was instrumental in recruiting many volunteers. After enlisting at Fort Leavenworth, he became Colonel Donovan, commanding the 1st Missouri Mounted Cavalry. He would be acclaimed as the hero of one of the longest military marches in history. His unit, composed of eight companies of 856 men, left Fort Leavenworth in early June 1846. On August 18th, they arrived in Santa Fe, where Donovan became the military governor and commandant. While there, he oversaw the drafting of a civil code that became the statutory law of the state of New Mexico. Donovan also negotiated a treaty with the Navajo Nation that is still honored today. He next led his troops to battle in Sacramento on February 28, 1847, then took possession of the city of Chihuahua. After two months, the regiment was ordered home. He marched 900 miles down into Mexico to the Gulf Coast, then boarded ship for New Orleans, arriving there on June 15, 1847. Over the campaign, Colonel Alexander Donovan and his troops had marched overland more than 4,000 miles with less than 100 casualties.